Hi, my name is Dr. Gary Belcher and welcome back. In this video we're going to be looking at third normal form versus Boyce-Codd normal form. In the previous video we looked at what third normal form is and to refresh your memory let's get it here on the whiteboard. To refresh your memory here's the definition for third normal form. A relation is in third normal form if for every function dependency x is on the left hand side it's a set of attributes, a is on the right hand side it is non-prime and it's a member of F closure then X has to be a super key. So for every functional dependency where the right hand side is non-prime the left hand side has to be a super key. Now for Boyce cod normal form all we do is the following. In Boyce cod normal form for every functional dependency the left hand side has to be a super key whether the right hand side is prime or whether the right hand side is non-prime. In third normal form if the right hand side is prime we don't care if the left hand side is a super key. Third normal form if the right hand side is non-prime then the left hand side has to be a super key. Boyce cod normal form left hand side has to always be a super key. Now let's take a look at an example. Now here's an example where we have R, A, B, C and two sets of functional dependencies. A, B function determines C and C function determines A. Now in this example the keys are as follows. A, B is a key and B, C is a key. So all the attributes are prime. Now if we look over here the right hand side is prime but the left hand side is a super key we're okay. However in this example the right hand side is prime and it doesn't matter whether this is a super key in third normal form but in Boyce cod normal form this has to be a super key. It's not, so this is in third normal form, but not Boyce Cod normal form. Hope this helps. Thanks a lot.